Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for April 3rd and 4th, Wednesday and Thursday, for my Sagittariuses. Hello, my Sagittarius. Hope all is wonderfully well for you. I really do. Okay, short reading. So I just used my Doreen Virtue Angel Tarot cards. I had prayed, meditated, and infused with Reiki energy. Oops, the cards almost fell. And this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate with you. Take what you like, leave the rest. So, had an awesome weekend. Um, I did a couple of readings. Very, very positive energy people. Um, one was an energy healer in Germany. Wow. The other was a wonder. He was one of the winners, Marcus, in Las Vegas. Great guy. Very positive. I came from these readings with kind of a new thought. Well, not, it may not be new, but it was my new thought about energy and negative energy. Um, you know, negative energy is like having, is like junk food to your, oh, is like junk food to your soul. It is unhealthy and it's also very addicting, okay? So it was, it's like, that's why it's very, that's why I'm always pushing, always talking about um, feeding yourself positive thoughts and making sure that your words are positive too, okay? So let's go on. Okay, we're gonna, one card did pop. Let's go ahead and cut for the other two cards and see what we have for our Sagittariuses. Okay, glasses on. Let's see. First card, face down, the seven of air. And air, of course, is our Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. It is our Wi-Fi. Also, too, it's our subliminal thought processes. You know that thought when you get up and you go to the refrigerator and say, why am I looking in the refrigerator? You know, I must be hungry. It's kind of that thought, too. So this is that thought that actually undermines you a little bit. It, um, you know, I, I feel, not, I don't mean that all this energy does, but I'm feeling that this is the thought that when we were just talking about negative, that it just kind of creeps in. It's like it's, it's like those um, haunted movies and you see the smoke creeping in underneath the um, doorway. It's like it, try, it tries to creep in into your mind. So I'm really going to caution my Sagittarius is to really, really work very hard on your mind and your, and your mouth speaking, thinking and speaking very positive thoughts. Also reading positive things, watching positive, listening to positive. So this one is plans that meet need revision more going on than meets the eye poor timing i i'm not you know again i'm feeling that this is more about you it, it's like you know i can feel that there's some sagittarius and saying well this is just my luck um this is you know what do i expect this is what you know i i must just deserve this and it's really no no you don't deserve this okay you don't but you have to start, you know, doing like a, like a, a mental cleanse. You know, if you're listening to, um, you know, to music that's, that's very um, violent or, you know, I know you need to then listen to things that aren't. If you're reading things, if you're reading, um, you know, the internet and you're just reading about all the crimes going on, you have to start, you know, you have to start doing some shifts. Okay. You have to shift what you're looking at. So if that means that you're looking at Facebook and looking at um, videos about puppies doing cute things, watch them. Watch them. Get that mind. It's like if you, if you, and this is one of the things that one of the, the you know, Petra from the energy he healing, you know, the person in Germany, she was like, you, you know, she was telling me how every time you start thinking and saying more and more positive, it like reconnects a piece in your mind. Okay? So it's like, you need to keep doing that, and you need to start changing that. Okay, I know I'm, this is just a short reading. I'm going into more things. I'm sorry, but I felt somebody needed to hear that. Okay, second card is the Page of Fire. This is your energy. Very passionate, very believable. Be you know, like this is the one that you will walk through fire for something that you believe in. I feel that for you. Outgoing, creative, confident, mischievous, news of an exciting endeavor. Use your originality and ingenuity 
So this could be, if you're looking for work, this could be, again, that job offer. This could be something that's just one of those things that you've been kind of hoping for, but not necessarily thinking it was going to come because you've been saying, oh, it's just my luck, you know, but it's actually, it, you know, it could pop out. Now, you have to keep that, that thought process. I'm, I'm really going to work on you. It's really, it's really for you, Sagittarius. You have to keep it positive or you might miss it. Okay? Okay. And then you're going to say, I missed it, Debbie. What do I do? Don't. No, it will come, you know, it comes again, but keep it positive because the energy is very much that it's like, it's like, it's, it's, it's focusing on what you're putting out, what you're projecting. Okay. It really is. And if you just, if you say, you know what, um, I lost $20 instead of saying, oh my gosh, oh my, you know, say, well, I hope somebody who needed it found it. You see, it's like switching it up, switching it up. So let's see what this last card, this last card is reversed actually. So a little more powerful message for you. And this is the three of water and water energy is of course our Cancer, Pisces and our Scorpio. It's very emotional energy. It's very fluid energy. And this is saying a celebration, a wedding, graduation or birth announcement, the need to have more fun. So, you know, these two cards here, are very, very positive cards. These two cards are saying, yay, exciting stuff, weddings, have more fun, originality, and then we have, oh, but do I deserve it card. Well, you know what? That one, these two, this is two against one, so I'm going to say yes, you deserve it. Okay? Yes, you deserve it. You do. You do deserve it. So these are general energy. So again, try to use that with what you're doing. And again, keep your thoughts positive and keep your words positive. Okay? Okay. So my Sagittarius, as always, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.